stars just got rich today, rich with nominations for a Screen Actors Guild Award. And can I just say, Niecy Nash and Olivia Munn clearly get the award for Best Announcing Duo. Benedict Cumberbatch, Sherlock, the lying detective. Was, it, was that too dramatic? I'm gonna step it up on my turn next time. <laughs> get, okay, let's get through this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give it to you guys. Okay. Taking what is usually a laundry list of nominees read from a teleprompter and making it all their own. Uzo Aduba, Orange is the New Black. Yes! Is that good? That okay, was great! First of all, the Nisi and Olivia show, I need it in my life. I need it in my life. Nisi and Olivia met for the first time just this morning. They told me it was a spontaneous decision to go totally off script. Blackish. You could have pointed to me. You could have been like, Blackish. But then that's all the press would be about, is that I pointed to you. Go! If fresh off the boat comes up, don't point at me. Okay. Well, somebody's just probably writing a buddy comedy for us right now. The duo are setting the tone for what is going to be a celebration of women in Hollywood when the SAG Awards broadcast live January 21st on TNT and TBS. E.T. has learned that all 13 acting awards will be presented by women. The nominees in the various categories include Nicole Kidman, Reese Witherspoon, Laura Dern, Margot Robbie, Allison Janney, and Mary J. Blige. Kristen Bell has also been tapped as the first ever SAG Awards host. She told us the pressure is on to get it right. I'm so nervous. The stakes are high, I guess, being the first person ever, because you, you have other people to look to if you do a different award show. It is also the first time Kevin Spacey has not been nominated as an actor in House of Cards. He was fired last month for allegations of sexual misconduct. Spacey's on-screen wife, Robin Wright, was recognized. And having Robin Wright get nominated, I mean, she should have gotten nominated. I'm super excited for her to hold down that show on her own.